Hello everyone, today we are going to be doing another pick a card reading. Today we are going to be doing who is your Valentine's and I'm not a massive fan of Valentine's Day, I think you should love everybody any day but today we're going to see if you're going to have a Valentine's this year. So please pick from this spread, we have group one, group two and group three and please select your selection and we will get started. So first off, we're going to start off with group one. Group one. So you guys got honouring your true feelings, vacation, financial flow, and you also got the Knight of Swords. So I'm, for the first of all, Knight of Swords is a very fast moving knight, a very fast moving person. So I'm feeling like um, you are already in a relationship and you are going to go out and you're going to go out somewhere different maybe actually have a physical vacation like actually going out and going out and doing something so but for those of you who are single um I'm definitely feeling like um there's a person around you uh well, there's a person coming in really quickly you're going to offer you um a date um, it might not be specifically on Valentine's Day, but I'm definitely feeling an actual date um, somewhere. And I'm feeling like it's going to be an, a place you've never been before, even if it's literally just going to like a different restaurant or if it's, it might even be an actual vacation. But I'm definitely feeling like you will have a Valentine, whether it'll be someone new, someone you already know, or someone you're already in a relationship with. And I'm definitely feeling like it'll be somewhere where you can um, splash out your money you'll have enough money to spend or he will spend his money on you um he, this might be an indication that the fact that he is quite a well-off person the person or he or she is a well-off person who you're going to spend um valentine's day with and this is going to be someone who's going to really connect with you on a deep level because you two are going to honor your true feelings with each other and i feel like you're going to dress up for this day you're going to wear something really nice and you're going to spend time on the way you look. Um, this can also be, I, I'm definitely feeling this, you're, you're honouring yourself. So you could actually be taking a self-care day. But this Knight of Swords is definitely telling me that someone is on their way. Whether they are spending Valentine's Day with you or not. So I'm getting a couple of mixed messages. Um, I'm definitely, for, for sure, there is someone around you. So this may be very close to Valentine's Day that they're spending this day with you. You might actually... What I'm, actually, what it might be is you might not spend Valentine's Day on actual Valentine's Day, but you may celebrate Valentine's Day on a different day, maybe the day before, the day after, that sort of thing. But definitely someone is coming in for you who's got quite a lot of money um, and is very attractive, <clears throat> excuse me, very attractive as well. And yeah, this is really, really good. This is very short and sweet. Um, I don't feel like I need to actually say anything else. Is there anything else that the universe wants me to say? You two, as I say, are very are going to connect very on a very deep emotional level. You two are very similar with each other. And with this financial flow, the fact that there's two streaks coming in here, I'm definitely feeling like someone is really going to connect with you on every level. And you're both going to have the same, almost the same kind of beliefs about money and how you should spend it. And there's going to be no, it's all going to be very balanced. So definitely someone is coming in for you very strongly. This is more like a love reading, if I'm honest, like proper love reading. Like this isn't just Valentine's Day. I definitely feel like this is actually an overall reading for February. So you guys have got a really nice reading. So look out for this Knight of Swords coming in. And thank you for watching. If you'd like to, please subscribe to my channel. My name is The Crystal Girl. I appreciate you here watching this video. Um, I'm very new to all of this. So if this, re if this resonated with you, please comment down below. I would love to know if this resonated with you. And please like and comment down below. And I will see you in the next video. Bye. So moving on to group number two. Let's see what you guys got. So you guys got happily ever after, higher consciousness and romantic partner, hello, there he is. And you also got the five of swords. So what I'm thinking is you guys have been working on yourself and you've really been looking into the spiritual aspect of your life. Um, you've really been connecting with spirit 
And this Five of Swords is about winning. And I feel like it's also about defeat, but I feel like you have gone through a few relationships because these people are very sad in the background, but you are here with the Three Swords and you've almost like defeated the past. So I feel like you've gone through a great deal of, um, I want to say nasty men. <laughs> I'm trying not to say it in a really bad word because my mouth can be quite bad sometimes when I get into this zone. So um, yeah, I feel like you've been going through a lot of bad eggs in terms of relationships. Um, it doesn't have to be exactly full on relationships, maybe dates, maybe um, friendships. And I feel like you've gone through a lot. So I feel like this Valentine's Day, because you've been working on yourself, there will be a happily ever after. This may not be actually on Valentine's Day. You may you may actually be celebrating it on Valentine's Day. I'm feeling, um, yeah, I'm feeling it could be on Valentine's Day or around that date. And there is a romantic partner here for you. Because the romantic partner's already here, <clears throat> I'm feeling like you are already in a relationship or um, you could already know someone who you want to spend Valentine's Day with or you have... <clears throat> <clears throat> or you have a rough idea of who you want to spend Valentine's Day with. Um, this may also be a new romantic partner coming in. So if you don't know who this is, there may be someone coming in who is very spiritual and very similar to you. And this can end in a happily ever after. So definitely there is someone around you, whether you know it or not. Or if there isn't anybody at all, there is definitely someone coming in. Um... There may be that you may not spend Valentine's Day with this person, but this person is definitely around you. Definitely around in February. So look out for this guy and be open to any opportunities for our romantic partner in the future. Uh, let me see if there's any other messages coming through. So yeah, you've definitely had a win to do with your emotions. You've been working on your emotions very deeply. And you've become more into your spirituality where I feel like you can actually sense this guy coming in um, before he's actually coming in. I feel like you've got this sense that someone is coming in. You've got this almost like this higher knowing that you're... <clears throat> you've also got this higher knowing that your person is there. So definitely there is someone around. Um, yeah, I'm not too sure... Um, if this will be on exactly Valentine's Day, but this is someone definitely coming in. You will, I think you will have a good Valentine's Day anyway, whatever you're doing. Um, but yeah, this person is coming in and you have worked on yourself. So congratulations on that. Like you're doing really, really good. So that is what I feel like is gonna happen on Valentine's Day. Uh, as I say, there may be someone coming in for you and I think there definitely is someone coming in um, because it will ha end up in this happily ever after because you've worked on yourself and you've put in the effort. If not, um, if not, I mean, if if you're in a relationship already, yes, you will be spending Valentine's Day with someone. And yeah, so either way, you will have somebody coming in for you, whether on Valentine's Day or not. So, but anyway, you will have a good Valentine's Day. So thank you for watching. If you would like, please subscribe to this channel. My name is The Crystal Girl. I would really appreciate it. And please comment down below if this resonated with you. If not, you will feel free to choose any of the other groups. Uh, thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye. So group number three. Hello, everyone. So we have self-reliance. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Making new friends. Visualization. And the Ace of Pentacles. Wow. Okay, so definitely you guys have been working on yourself. You have been visualizing this partner coming in. Um, this is also to do with new friends as well. So you guys might be friends first. Um, you may be friends now, and then you may get to spend Valentine's Day with this person. You may spend Valentine's Day with your friends instead. Um, that doesn't mean that you haven't got a partner coming in because the Ace of Pentacles is really drawing me into the fact that you're, you're going to have this sort of like this offer. Um, I feel like this offer is around work because the Ace of Pentacles is, due, um, is to do with money. So I definitely feel like you have been really visualising um, a good year this year and you've been visualising an ideal partner and I really feel like you have been working on your emotions and as I say I think this is hanging out with friends or this could be a male friend who you have quite a high attraction to 
Um, but I feel like you will be spending Valentine's Day with somebody. Um, and I feel like there is an offer of love coming in very soon. I think more in the month of March, if anything. Um, but you are going to spend Valentine's Day with people who you love. This could also be family, someone who is very close to you. Um, but it's going to be a good day for you. I feel like because you've spent the time and you've worked on yourself, you are self-reliant. And I feel like because of this self-reliance, you've built up this confidence to have this inner knowing that you don't have to spend Valentine's Day with somebody. Um, I don't feel like, from this, I don't feel like you're the sort of person who needs to have somebody but I feel like you want someone because you've been visualizing new opportunities um so I feel like you are on the right track to have making some new friends making um having a new partner um so either way I feel like there is a possibility that you may not spend valentine's day with a lover but a lover is coming in um, and new opportunities are coming in to bring in this new partner. So if an opportunity comes towards you, um, this could lead you on to a new romantic partner. And I think that's it, guys. Um, you're very self-reliant as well. So I feel like because you're self-reliant, this opportunity is going to come in quite fast for you because you know what you want and the universe is going to be answering your questions. So thank you guys for watching. I know this is very short and sweet, but that is what I was getting. So thank you for watching. If you would like, please subscribe to my channel. My name is The Crystal Girl. Please like and comment down below to let me know if this resonated with you. I'm really appreciative of all of you who are here right now. Um, I'm very new to this. So I really hope this resonated with you. If it did, please let me know. That is just a massive confirmation for me. That makes me very happy. So thank you for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.